Rolling. What's up, guys? What up, Luggy? So today we're making Christmas cookies. It's cookie machine and print. Let's go. Boop, 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 boop. Except I already made all the dough. Uh, cut to that clip of how that went right now. All right, guys. So a bit of a fail on cookie night. <laughs> it's not a fail. We're still doing it. Well, no, this is a fail, but we are still doing it. Um, no you'll notice Brittany is not using the we mixer. Say that we got a new mixer. Oh, well, we got a new mixer. Brittany spent a lot on it and uh, she's not using it. And it's, it broke after the first time that I used it. I didn't do anything did it, wrong. Did it actually work the first time without having yeah. to mess with it? Yes. Okay. Turned so just fine the first time and then it said, never mind, I don't want to work. Yeah. I promise I didn't break it. I didn't do anything. Yeah, so, th so this is probably TMI, but uh, like one thing about electronics is that if they're going to fail, they're most likely to fail right when you get them. And so it's it's like, you know, 2% of electronics that they sell are going to be what's called dead on arrival. Um, so we got a DOA KitchenAid and now we have to go do another chore, take it back and go get another one. Um, so we're hoping I'll go do it tomorrow. that there's we'll no problems like with the summer. return policy. She went to the beach and took all of the disco balls and surrounded herself with them so that the light was a million percent on her body. I hurt so bad about these my hands. Get in there. Dig on in, boy. I feel like your hands might do better. But I think you want to put uh, the powder on them first so they don't get so Stop gross. Flower. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> Not my job. Have fun, Brittany. Wait, you didn't tell them what we're doing. You didn't say hi vlog, like, what's oh, up? Oh, well, because I figured this was after the intro. This oh. is just something to throw in there to show them the trials and tribulations which we have gone through. Did I test it? No. I'm good. Yeah, so I made all the dough. Shane didn't help. So it's really just like cooking with Brittany and decorating with Shane. But uh, we're going to make Christmas cookies. I have all these fun cutters that I got at Target. And yeah, we're also going to be answering your guys' questions that we asked on Instagram. Um, and so right now we're just going to cut the, the shapes out of the dough and then we have to bake before we can decorate them, obviously. So I figured we would do all the questions that are on my Instagram and then when we're decorating them, we'll do the questions from Shane's. Sound good? And there's a bunch of spicy questions on my Instagram and so we... Gonna us, he always yeah. gets the better questions for some reason. I get the... Anyways. So, yeah. So I rolled them out already. They chilled in the fridge. I can link the recipe below if you guys want it. Um, my sister gave me the website. She's like, the stuff from there is always really good. Because I wanted to make sugar cookies that actually were going to taste good and not just like be for decorating. Because I feel like when you get the kind from the pouch, they like turn hard when you bake them and they're like not even good. So hopefully these taste good. You'll see. Batter tasted good. Don't. Okay. So we want to start? Yeah. Have Santa. my eye on this guy right here. I got the cat. Okay, so do you do this edge? No, or that? it's quite hey, good. Sorry, it's spicy. And try to do it like uh, at the side. Yeah, so that you can fit as many as possible because we're gonna have to right, so re-roll it, roll it and re-roll it times. Well, you have to anyways. Oh, but okay. it's... So and somebody you... asked, um, "Are are you worried about stalkers?" Which is kind of an interesting question. Yeah. Um. Yeah, sometimes it crosses my mind. Uh. But I mean, nothing has, has happened yet that's like kind of scary, and I mean, I don't live alone, so that's helpful, like, um, Shane's here, so, you know, so. Yeah, even me living alone is like kind of scary, like, because I, I like lived alone for a little bit, and it just like, when you go from living with people to being completely alone and yeah. no dog or anything, it feels really weird. So if you live alone, I recommend a dog. Yeah, I only lived a, a, alone on like in Hawaii uh, for like a year, but then the house, my friend and her boyfriend lived in the main house, and like my studio was attached to it. Like the wall, we shared the same wall. Yeah, plus so, Max was there, so you were all good. Yeah, oh yeah, he's gonna protect me. <laughs> uh, oh, frick. Okay, some of the some of the things that people ask me on my questions make no sense. Also, so I'm not even gonna. Someone asked, how do you like living on the island? Well, we bought a house here, so obviously we like it. Yeah, not, not trying to leave anytime soon. People would ask me before, like, like, so do you think you want to live here long term? And I already had like the boat and the truck. 
Because, like, oh, they're like, cutting cookies up. It's like messing the shape up. That's what I'm saying. They're like, it's like ripping. Ah. Okay, sorry guys. This is like requiring lots of frick. This is not working. My Santa's head got smooshed. I think we got to put them in there, chill them out for a little bit. How do, how is this supposed to work? Oh man. I feel like it's not even done. Like I'm not feeling heat from the lights or anything. I think you just had to extra chill it before you did this. No, I followed the exact directions. Oh, it didn't right. say to extra chill it. It said this was the, the next, what is this? This thumb doesn't count. Oh no, my Santa Claus. He's missing a leg. It's not even cute. You can't decorate a, a Santa Claus with one For leg. anyone out there that's missing a leg, you count, okay? Ignore what Brittany said. Okay, here's a question. Ham rolls. I told you How that is that a question? I'm, I wasn't even going to say that one. <laughs> okay, but if all else fails, then those good. I'm just gonna roll out this piece of dough that we already, that's sitting out and refrigerate it. Where do you get swimsuits and swim gear? We both have our Amazons linked, um, so go check I don't that get out. Any swimsuits on Amazon, though. No. Oh, well, uh, I get like my spearfishing stuff from Hammerhead. They have an Amazon storefront, um, so you can get uh, stuff from there. Um, Shane did a really bad job in answering the question. Sorry, I was reading other questions. Surf shops. Yeah, surf shops is a good one, cause, like, well, so did Bethany surf shop have like cute bikinis or very rarely? Uh, yeah, they were just cut for the yeah. Okay. We sold billabong and all the same stuff. It was right. Just like we would sell, not like thongs. But right. That's not what's in style there, so they're considered cute. Yeah. Say, so, so if you're wanting to get like like Brittany's exact style of bikini, you may have to look online if. You don't live like in Hawaii, LA, or Brazil. I don't know where else. Maybe Florida has uh, bikinis that are more revealing. There's a couple questions in here where I'm like, whoa, that's too spicy. Yeah, I told you my questions are not what you said on the internet. Uh, someone's, it's an assumption you are six foot. So Brittany is 5'11. Five, 5'10. Five, by 10. Well, you're, maybe you're 5'11 <laughs> with this guy up top. And then I'm 6'3. I was just watching a video today where people get their legs like broken to make them taller. Yeah. And we're already like max height, so we don't need that. But isn't that crazy that people do that? Okay, there was one more. Oh, an assumption that neither of us studied at university. We actually both have. Uh, difficult degrees, I would say. She has a master's in business, and then I have a degree in mechanical engineering. So we, we both went to school because we were told to go to school, and then got out of it, and then we're like, I don't know if I want to do that. I already knew when I was in school I don't want to do that. I was like, dang, I want to go to the beach all day every day. I don't want to go to work. <laughs> yeah. Um, but yeah, I hate, I really hate how society is like, Oh, you finished high school? College. That's the only option. You have to go to college. College is next. I and wonder like, if society is still like that for graduating seniors. I think, I think it has not moved. If, it, if you you're in high school, drop a comment if everyone's pressuring you to go to college or if they're telling you that you should do I don't think we have any something non traditional. Okay. <laughs> I think all of our followers are. Got a bunch of old men. <laughs> Alright, is this thing chilled out enough yet? Where'd you put it? Outside. I just put it out there. Oh, well, yeah. Is, is there anything in that freezer? No. Oh, it's going to take forever to cool out. It looks like it's working better. Uh, yeah, so I didn't leave them in the freezer very long. We turned the camera off and I was like, eh, I better check them because it says fridge, not freezer. And I don't want the dough to like dry out. So I checked them and it was easier to peel apart. Like only easy right in the beginning. Like as soon as they start warming up at all, they're like, the dough is very sticky. Like, so I had to quickly take them off and I didn't have time to be ashamed. Right. What, what are you doing? It's a bug. You know, with some protein in your cookies. Uh, so the first tray is. We'll try these ones a little quicker. So there we go. 
The first tray is in the oven. Unfortunately, none of the Santos survived. They both Okay, work. hold on. Let me try to do a Santa. Let the, watch out. Let the master do it, okay? You have to use a spatula. Top priority. Oh, what? He did it. A good Santa. Like I said, guys, let the master do his thing. So why am I doing this? Boom, Santa? right the there. Master. Epic Santa, right there. Let's go. I think maybe the dough is too thin the first time. Yeah. Okay, someone said, you're a douche, but they spell, they use the wrong form of your, and then uh, put ah with a little okay. backwards accent in Okay, French. but just one thing what? I'd like to say. What? I use the wrong form of your all the time. Okay. And I hate when people correct me. I'm like, oh. yeah, or we're not in English class right now. <laughs> you know what I meant. Probably the most common thing you'll hear is that you are both dating. Who are you dating? Oh my gosh. Yes, guys, we're dating. I don't know how you don't know that by now. We, we are both <laughs> dating. We literally bought a house together. I don't know how more obvious it has to be. But. Well, you know why? It's because I have like four different your brother and sister questions. I cringe. I hate that question. It all started when I made a video and I said, Help me step Brittany, I'm stuck, or something like that. That was like three years which ago. Which is so long ago, and it was supposed to be like the joke that's like, help me step brother, step sister, blah, blah, blah. Which still, uh, in those videos, they're not related, and so that was like the joke. And Nobody like, I got his joke. Yeah, basically. and I get that some people are like, oh, they look alike, blah, blah, blah. But then like, lots of people who are in couple look alike. Uh, Ooh. you just scratched yourself. Why well, is your hand there? Because I'm talking with my hands. <laughs> uh, and so like lots of people who are couples like look alike. Like it would be like if you said the two people with brown hair. Oh, yeah, you must be siblings. Yeah, we have the same color eyes and we have the same color hair. So you guys are like, you guys are siblings. Yeah, like you've never seen people with blonde hair and blue eyes before. Come on. Okay, so I have gotten the hang of this cookie thing. You're on a roll right now, guys. Okay, someone has the assumption you guys are really citizens of Atlantis and faking being human. Yes, that is true. <sighs> you caught us. I didn't want to reveal it yet. We're going to have to... Um, We're going to make we a separate get, video about this. Yeah, we might get excommunicated from our Atlantean brothers and sisters, but uh, yes, we are secretly Atlantean, and <laughs> that's why we're so good in the ocean and all of can these you, things. Can you open the first one? My hands are greasy. Yeah. Okay, someone said a raw cookie dough, pro or con. Brittany already ate some. What do you think about that? Yeah, I, if it's in a tub, I eat it. She's it's good with weird. the chocolate chips in it. No, this is good, you should try a piece. Okay. Well, because my mom would always yell at me if I would oh eat Oh my God, raw your mom is dough. low key like paranoid about everything though, so. Watch, I get some and I'll poison you off of it. You ate the smallest piece, how are you even gonna taste that? Tastes like sugar, egg, and butter. Uh, ew, I'm supposed to be cooking. It's okay, guys. No one else eating these cookies except us. Max is secretly a dog. True. <laughs> Who said that? Connor? <laughs> Come here, doggy. Boy. Santa came out. Wait, why did, Fire. why did we not get the peach emoji uh, cookie cutter? We didn't have one. Oh, that would have been good. It's someone, since Christmas cookies. Someone said you're making cookies in the shape of her. <laughs> I can probably say. We that. are. Look. What? <laughs> That's not what I meant. That's not what they said. I said the peach emoji, not the cat emoji. I'm just kidding. No, those are going to be so hard. Oh, I don't know. Shane burned the first batch. Oh, she told me to look at them. I looked at them. I was like, yep, that's cookies. Okay, the last batch is gonna be way better. Do they taste okay? Yeah, they're just a little bit dry. Yeah, because they're overcooked. I meant the flavor, not like how they were cooked. I don't know what it's supposed to do. It's like a cookie, I don't know. We're being filmed right now. We're gonna call this out, this is boring. <laughs> do it. 
Okay, now we're having a dance party while we wait for the cookies to be done. Come on, bring him dance. <laughs> Do one of these. <laughs> wait, 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 Brett. So, so that we might not be able to put, but then you can literally, you can literally go like this. What? <laughs> <laughs> it's too late, I'm tired. Oh no! <laughs> Guess uh, there's no more video because Brittany's done. Out of commission. It's too late. She can't talk anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Laughing too hard. I said these are kind of dry. Uh, I and mean, they don't taste like anything. Okay. <laughs> yeah, you asked me what they taste like and I said they need icing and you're like, no, what's the flavor? And I was like, <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> because Nothing. the ones my sister were gonna like send me to make yeah. tastes really good. Like but not too so sweet. Uh -huh. Yeah, without icing. Yeah. But they're not the kind you cut into shapes. Right. Maybe the shape is making it taste bad. Yeah, icing and I was just gonna taste like icing. That's why I wanted to try on without. Okay, well I'm gonna set it off with this crooked tree. <laughs> um Okay, so here's what we have. Cupcake icing, so we're gonna have to spread it with a knife because it's gonna come out poofy. Okay. And then I mean you don't have to use the white icing on everyone. Uh, and then I have all these gels. They're all sparkly except the black one. So I have blue, green, red, and black. And then sprinkles. That's there right. was one on mine that was like, what are your favorite and least favorite Oh, yeah, yeah. By each other. But I know you've answered it in a before, but I have a new one. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, let's, let's answer that. We'll get started on these. Basically, you guys know the trend on TikTok. He's not going to know because he doesn't watch TikToks. Um, when you like say each other's icks or whatever. One of my biggest things about Shane is he has to cook all his food on the highest heat possible so that the oil splatters literally everywhere and then I have to clean the cabinets, the microwave, all of the burners and we have a gas stove so I have to lift up the things and clean everywhere like the counter, there's oil everywhere, everywhere. It drives me nuts. That's what I have to say. Oh. So that's like what you don't like about me? Yeah. Okay. And then now you're supposed to go. <laughs> I feel like, uh, I don't know. Like, cause I don't like to think bad things about someone. So oh, now you're making me seem horrible. No, that's what you're no, no, no. Like, I wish I had something that was like, like, cause I don't want to like, Say something that's like so awful that it would make you upset, you know? Uh, Did that make you upset? No. No. Because that's kind of like, ha ha. <laughs> like, because what am I going to do? Not enjoy the way that I cook my food? Yeah, not burn all your food. Like, he cooks on... Food. None of my food gets burnt. It all comes out I made out great. literally chicken tenders fried in oil. And I made like probably like four or five panfuls of them and I made less oil splatters than he makes during making his own breakfast. Um, Brittany likes to overcook her vegetables. <laughs> you can't say the same thing basically that I just said. Whoa, that's a thick boy. <laughs> I thought that's what you're supposed to do. I said you could spread it out. Oh no, I accidentally shot my icing all over your your kitty, Brittany. Don't say that. <laughs> what the heck? Oh, so when you say it, it's okay. Yeah, exactly. Got it. Um, so one thing I really like about Brittany is, uh, like I was saying earlier, how she like compliments my skill sets or what I'm bad at or whatever. 
Um, but then also something that I like about her that like, I feel like I'm good at is that like, we're both like driven to succeed and like make money and like hustle and stuff. And so it's like cool that, uh, she's not just like, I'm hot, so I don't do anything. Uh, cause that's like a really lame attitude that some people have. Um, and to me, like your attitude about life and everything is like, what's most important in a partner? Oh, that was so nice. Yeah. Yeah. I'm making an angry cat. Meow. <laughs> so how Shane is so fast at these things. Like when we carved pumpkins, he carved two in the time that I carved one. I gotta look up what a cat looks like. <laughs> we have one in the house. That's, I, that's too realistic. <laughs> okay, I didn't want to anime cat, dang it. Uh, that whisker was thicky thick. <laughs> This looks so dumb, I can't. Oh, jeez. <laughs> that is not good. It was looking good until I put the black on. <laughs> but if we just cover it up. <laughs> jeez, who would, who would ever want to draw this cat? <laughs> it's like photorealistic but then just outline and it's like if you're drawing a cat you want that thing to look cute Meow. like that <laughs> like funny this literally looks like the cookies that i made when i was a kid like i said he's a master with the angry cat Thank you for laughing at me. <laughs> oh, and I never said my thing that I like about Shane. I like that he's so creative with his videos and like when he gets inspired, it's really cool. Uh, when he's like, I'm gonna make a cool video about this. And then he's like telling me what he's gonna make some video about based on what we saw in the ocean or something. I think that's cool. Yeah. Did anyone ask any new questions? <laughs> Wait, someone said, damn boy, he thick. But it's not Tyler, it's Kawabunga Peppermilk. About what? Oh, the just, cat. No, just replying to our question. They could be saying that about Max. Oh, yeah, maybe. He was in the video. Here you go guys, the moment you've been waiting for. Picture perfect Santa made on a cookie. Follow me for more uh, cookie, decorating, uh, cookie decorating tutorials, uh, <laughs> creating photorealistic cookies with uh, icing that you can buy at, um, at your local store. Look, it's a green Christmas tree with ornaments. Like this one's cute. My best ones involve no white icing. Yeah. What um, is that? What is it? Why is it just a puff in the middle? Because that's the style. <laughs> Sheesh. Harsh criticism over here. Should we try one with icing? Yeah, sure. Which one should we eat? I'm, I'm going to eat the cat head. <laughs> 
<laughs> Wait, I'm, I might as well top it off with some sprinkles. Some sprinkies. <laughs> and what are the sprinkles? Cheers. Just chalk. Cheers. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. There's too much icing. Oh, it just broke. The cookie bar is pretty good. Yeah. Oh, I never told the told the dry cookie story. Mm. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna tell this really quick and then I think we'll go. Um, what dry cookie story? Okay, so when I was a junior in high school, in my Spanish class, we had an assignment where we had to cook something that was from uh, a Spanish speaking nation. And I made a pineapple upside down cake, apparently from Costa Rica or something. Um, I got like a C on it, even though I definitely had the best uh, cake, possibly because my mom made it for me. Um, but I, no, I think I did make all of it. She was just advising. Um, and then like, I'd always mess around in the videos too much. And so anyways, uh, this girl who, um, was she was like different for sure. Uh, but she was in all regular classes, so I can't say exactly what was going on with her. Um, but she was like super shy and, uh, was like, like, this is like the first time I've ever heard her speak besides like the assignments and maybe for the oral parts of the assignments, she wouldn't even speak. I don't know, but I swear this is the first time I ever heard her speak. And she like comes in and she's got all these cookies and she's like, yeah, I made cookies, um, but they're a little bit dry. So I don't know if anyone's going to want them. And then I was like, I was like, you know, trying to be supportive. It was the first time I heard her talk. Like I'm trying to like help her out. Like I feel like it's like hard in high school to like do that kind of thing, be on the spot. So I was like, I'll try your cookie. Like I'm sure they're great. Like don't worry. And then uh, I tried the cookie and it, it would be like if I like... Like, I almost can't describe to you how dry it was. Like, because I've eaten dry sand, and it was more dry than that. Um, it was it was like if I did the cinnamon challenge, but it, they somehow put all the cinnamon into a cookie, and then I bit it, and it just blew up <laughs> like the fattest cloud of powder. And, oh, that's a really nice one. Oh, I made and, a nice one. And she's looking at me while I'm eating it, and I'm like, you know, it's pretty dry. Because <laughs> what else can I say? It's not like I can be like, yeah, they're actually great. Everyone should have one. <laughs> like, it was, it was like cr crumbling to powder in my hands before I could even get it in my mouth. I'm trying to do a cookie. <laughs> and so it's just like the worst prepared food I've probably ever had. Um... This was in high school? Yeah, in high school. So yeah, some, some girl put like, probably like double the amount of flour that you're supposed to have and brought the cookies all the way to completion without giving up or being like, maybe I should redo this. <laughs> um, but yeah, so uh, shout out to that girl. I hope you've become <laughs> less awkward and I hope that you're enjoying life now and I hope that you've since then made better cookies. Um, and are a little bit more social because it must be really tough to not be able to Okay, this one's cute AF. Uh-huh. Okay, so after we're done decorating, we're going to cut... Well, we're not planning to decorate them anymore. But uh, before we say bye, you guys, I want to cut to a montage. Of? A, a close-up. Oh, okay. Of all of our uh, beautiful cookies, just so you can get a really good... Yeah, okay, so I'm going to film that. Definitely not right now, and when we finish decorating all of these cookies, because we're totally going to do all of them. Cinematic pans. Yeah, I want to be really cinematic. Drone even though, style. Even though the cookies look like shit. Okay, but like this. <laughs> All right guys, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you smash like. And then also, we don't normally say this, but go follow us on Instagram if you are one of the people that would like to see better questions on here, if you have a question, because 
we post these things on our stories and it feels like we don't get as many responses as we should. Well, I know how to get more responses. Uh -huh. If I started answering them, then people would ask more. Oh, right. But then I like don't want then to answer them. them yeah. yeah. So I think a lot of my followers don't follow me on Instagram that are on YouTube. And then my Instagram totally. followers don't follow me on YouTube. So it's like I have different followers. Yeah. And then also next time we'll do a community post on YouTube like the day before. Um, where you can ask questions there. I think that will help also. Okay. Uh, if we have like, like, cause that's for you guys right there. Um, so make sure you follow the community tab. Also go check it. You just have to go to your subscriptions. You'll see what's on your community tabs. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching guys. Hope you enjoyed this video, uh, of us playing in the kitchen. It's cookie with Shane and Britt segment one. Yeah. Let me know if you want more, not Christmas themed stuff. Yeah. Why are you staring at me? <laughs> and, and Brittany will wear an even smaller crop top <laughs> next time. <laughs> okay, thanks for watching. Smash subscribe, and that's all the stuff Happy we saw. Bye! bye. <laughs>